I'm going to have a little hate take because I've been too positive today. People keep talking about the Pistons. They People keep talking about the Wizards. People keep talking about Scoot. Yo, the Hornets suck again? <laughs> Yo, like, like, come on, bro. Yeah. Like, come on, bro. Let's, just, let's really talk, bro. I'm not going to lie. I was on the LaMelo train. I'm not trying to say he suck. But my guy, he might not be numero UNO, bro. Because are they bad again? It, 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 may, it may be Michael Jordan is all to blame. We just had that conversation. <laughs> Whatever it is, somebody got to go. And it got to be somebody of substance. I'm tired of seeing, yo, we might trade Gordon Hayward. I don't want to hear no, no more of that, bro. This, this is... Mm-mm. Mm. It's, hard see, it's hard to see when you do nothing but put criminals in an area that <laughs> indulges criminal you know, activity. Like, I, know, I've never seen a team let so much slide. I, again, I am an hour and a couple of minutes away from Charlotte. The shit that be on the news <laughs> about Hornets <laughs> players. I lived, I lived in Indiana. They weren't talking about the Pacers like this then. I, I lived in New York. What nobody talk about Knicks and Nets players like this. I lived in Sacramento. No one gave a fuck about DeMarcus Cousin. He wasn't doing nothing crazy in these streets. But Charlotte? These niggas falling asleep with guns in the car. They rappers turn woman abusers. They're drug addicts. I don't care what nobody say. Kai Jones was on drugs on Instagram Live. I don't care what nobody says. And, and LaMelo is a deviant. Tra he's a traffic deviant. I wouldn't be surprised if he had 100 plus unpaid parking, uh, unpaid traffic citations. That nigga literally oh, yeah, that runs the red light yeah, every game. The end of every game, he runs the red light right outside the arena. Every single one. I'm like, I'm just waiting for him to get T-boned and then blame someone else. This is crazy. Niggas nah, out of control down there. Now, nah, let me say this because they gonna harp on it. Chat, I I know he was hurt as the motherfucker that shuffled through the uh, playback Hornets games. I'm like, damn, where LaMelo? I know he was hurt. He, I know he just came back, and I'm not even necessarily deeming his play for not playing well in the past couple games. But, uh, dog, you don't even have to do that much, Chat. Just go to LaMelo stats. You see they got their ass blown out twice by the Spurs for one of them. And then yeah. even the three before that, it's like, okay, you had close games with uh, – no, you got blown out by the Magic prior to that. Sorry. And he had two very, very close games with the Wiz – one one with the Wizards and then one overtime game in Boston. So even in the last five games he played, it looked like shit changed. No. Like, so I, I'm not I, – don't gaslight me into waiting another month of the Hornets being shit for me to say the Hornets are shit now. Stop. Y'all Y'all know they're bad Damn. again. Stop, and bro. to add on to that, P.J. Washington, you're lucky Zion's a freaky frog because you would have been the freakiest NBA player there was. you freaky frog. You're lucky Zion came out the way he did with the Mariah Mills thing because people will still be on your ass about why we were so invested in your baby mama drama with you being a, a, a Charlotte Hornet. And it's insane. Uh, sure. I, can't, I can't remember ever being invested in any basketball player's parental disputes, let alone a Charlotte Hornet. What the hell? Crazy. I, I will say this. Uh, what's his name? Might be like the um, Lamelo. Might end up being like the Vince Carter of this era, this generation. That'd be crazy. In the in the sense that, like, you know, how they talk about oh, Vince Carter has so much talent, he just couldn't mentally put it together. I I yeah. believe that Melo got a lot of like for real, for real. Like, oh yeah, yeah, Melo talented. Pause if needed, man. Melo talented. So. I don't I don't know why I'm looking at him now. Who's that? Twenty twenty five points per game. I don't know why Lamelo Ball can't average inefficient and maybe maybe we just truly 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 <clears throat> need to watch more games because i do think i think he's a bad finisher at the rim still yeah if okay. and that's definitely pause um if he could have i don't know why he can't average 27 plus points but i don't i don't I know, know. i know why because yeah, who are yeah. the other four <laughs> niggas on the court at the time he's on the court that's why they out there with half a terry rozier half the time other time they staggering minutes out there with a hobbled gordon hayward Whoever at center, shout out Mark Williams. I mean, you cool, Condor, but at the end of the day, that's just Mark Williams. Uh, they out there. Who's a power forward? PJ Washington. They up there battling court disputes with Miles Bridges. God forbid that you name a guard they drafted outside of Lamelo that's worth a damn. All them niggas seem to just be G League written. Nick Smith Jr., Amari Bailey, Theo Madlin, name them. It don't matter. All them niggas are two way contracts at guard. It's literally just. Lamelo Ball Show. You talking about Vince Carter? Hell no, nah, that's not Vince. Vince was a little competitive. This nigga is Steve Francis. I am. I, I know it. <laughs> Steve Francis. 
Man, I'm looking you, at his. You, you know, you know, this really is the LaMelo Ball show because this is my third time trying to explain to chat. I am not hating on LaMelo Ball. I said the Hornets suck. And niggas keep saying, yo, serious, but, but LaMelo's doing that. LaMelo's doing that. Yo, LaMelo. Bro, y'all keep talking about LaMelo. I'm saying the Hornets yet again are bad. That's how, that's how I know that's all they got. And to be honest, shit, shit, you might not deserve a motherfucker at this point. This is getting crazy, bro. The Literally. A historic losing team, and then the team closest to it on the standing search is the only reason nobody's talking about this shit. Because they they have been the team. Remember what the Hornets were supposed to be? Let's really talk about that. They should be in disappointing talks. In terms of the last five years, remember that one season where people were like, damn, the Hornets were healthy. They low-key mm -hmm. would have been like a top four. Mm -hmm. Dog. Like, like, I hate when NBA fans have amnesia, bro. Stop, bro. This team was supposed to be on timing by now, and they are bad again. Y'all should watch him play. I'm, I'm looking at his, his shots versus the Miami Heat, man. Why he look like GOIs for real? He should be out there chucking. He like Julian Newman, just 6'8. That's what Julian Newman would look like at 6'8. Just <laughs> dribble, 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 pull. Ah, let me look sexy for the cameras. Like, that's all he does. It's, it's, it's insane. It's like Jordan Poole aura with no talent around him. It's it's kind of crazy. It's it's insane. Um, this is a quick conversation before we get into the shenanigans. We're making good time. We're getting through these basketball conversations in the second half. Talked a lot about Mike. We're about to get back on his body. Um, Jalen Rose wants to know the great question. Talk to me. Oh shit! It always does this, huh? Always when you go full screen. I always got to reload. Crazy. Oh, no. Nah. For First real, for real. Foremost, we can't have an MJ versus Le Why he yelling? And what happened to his hair? This must be an old video. LeBron conversation because LeBron got to leapfrog some other people on the Mount Rushmore, everyone. Okay, there are some people that play basketball that accomplish some things and achieve the level of greatness that LeBron just has not been able to do. You want me to name them for you? Please. Besides Michael Jordan? Yes. You ever heard of a, a, a guy named Kareem Abdul-Jabbar? Mm -hmm. Okay. You you ever heard of a guy um, named Bill Russell? Bill Russell? Like you ever heard of a guy named Irvin Magic Johnson? It, it just when did LeBron pass Magic? Did I did I miss something? Did I miss something? I got this one. I'm gonna say I got this one. I think he <laughs> passed magic. I think he passed magic the day he didn't cheat on his wife and get AIDS. Is oh, all wow. I'm saying. I think that day. Boy, that no way, was the. Boy, ain't no way, boy. I beg your pardon. Why did if I, I had, him? if I had to pick an exact moment, it was the moment you realized. Wait, 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 wait. What if he does it? What if he does it like in two weeks or so? Oh, then the longevity he is still crazy. Like he's still <laughs> lasting longer. <laughs> I Vin beg Nash, your pardon. <laughs> who went out cheating and getting AIDS? Like he still lasted longer, so there's still a you there's can, still no conversation. No you can nod this off right now because you got to go on the panel tomorrow, don't you? That's why you get oh, it off man. right now. Yeah, I'm getting it off now. And I, <laughs> the new grind is coming. I'm getting all the nastiness off now because I'm not with them problems. But yeah, uh, there's no way, there's no world we're living in when we're looking at the resume of a Magic Johnson pre-AIDS and, and think about that compared to a LeBron James with no AIDS. Um, I. <laughs> That's just the AIDS is the killer, in my opinion. That's really it. Like, I don't have no on court shit because that should be obvious because one has AIDS and one doesn't. Like, people were scared to share the court with magic because they thought if he sweats on me, I'm gonna get it. That's how early he got okay. AIDS. Okay. He didn't even get okay. AIDS late. Okay. He got AIDS like he got version Down one. Of AIDS. Got, that's like the first COVID vaccine. Like, Nick, you got it this soon. In, like, in serious, in serious talks, I personally think he probably passed magic before he left Miami. No bullshit. I know that might sound crazy, oh niggas. God, yeah, yeah, yeah two, two rings. The defense. The oh, offense. Before he left Miami. Right, yeah, I before was, he I, left Miami. I don't know why I thought you said before he went to Miami. Oh, okay. uh, no, 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 no. That's crazy. Now that's crazy. <laughs> that, <laughs> now that, that would be. You know, yeah, I was <laughs> like, Jesus Christ. I don't know about that. And then also, I mean, come on now, Jalen. Bill Russell, that's shameless. We've got that's to stop. very distasteful. That's distasteful. We, we got to stop. The Kareem shit is distasteful. Like, let's be honest. Well, no, I, when did that? No, 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 no. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. Kareem all was Kareem pro black. Was he pro black? Yeah, he couldn't well, be. Yeah. Nah, he couldn't be because he had a white wife. Did he not? What? No, was he not with a white woman. Jabari Kareem didn't have a white woman. Black is the craziest. Was Kareem? 
Just look it up right now. That's, that's, that's not, not the hell to die on. Kareem, Kareem was more he was, he was more pro black than I'm about to say the ninety percent of his. I'm not, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not arguing who's more pro black. I'm just using today's today's checklist of what make you pro black. No, this woman is black. <laughs> is she is she white passer? No, she's black. All right, my fault, goat. My fault, goat. <laughs> <laughs> my fault, King. My fault, my fault I know your body was like that, King. Yeah. I, I no Wait, let me make sure. But my, fault, go. Go. My, my fault, go. My bad. I ain't, I ain't know you was getting down like that. Luau, my bad. Yeah, the guy, the guy. If you had to make Fender, that argument my fault. for his will uh, between the two, Kareem is. Not First of all, Will was fucking all the bitches, and it's crazy he didn't bring him on because that's the only guy that has an argument, in my opinion. Because when you're looking at when you look at what makes LeBron a GOAT, it's obviously longevity. Because I don't even think he peaked the absolute highest. I think there are, there has been – I think Michael Jordan's peak was higher. But LeBron sustained greatness wives. over – Was the second one white? Here you go. Here you go. Was he? Was he? No, 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 no. Let me get the information. Because if he left a black woman for a white woman, how poor black can you be? <sighs> She's got some olive in her skin, but it's mm. white. Here you go. Here you go. There it is. I knew, Ch- I, knew I wasn't bugging, man. The man was with a white woman who was trying to black pass a little bit. He didn't want all the repercussions in the 70s and 80s. He said, like, he knew he was never was a white woman. Nah, nah, was, I knew I wasn't was bugging. I knew I wasn't bugging. He yeah, you activated too, my track card. He left her too, though, so. <laughs> yeah, he's an asshole. I'll give it to you. <laughs> but, uh, big ring. But, no, nah, oh. I, I would legit argue Jordan. Be, I'm not Jordan. I would legit argue LeBron because of longevity. And all those players, I mean, you can say Kareem, but what are we going to say longevity wise to Kareem? Because longevity wise, LeBron put up better numbers, did he not? For a longer period of time, LeBron was a better player at an older age. Like Kareem was still an important player when he was 59 years old playing basketball. But let's not lie and act like he was better than what we're seeing from the chosen one. Like, come on, gang. And the Jordan thing, just overrated. Just, just in general, just overrated and overstated. Um, the lies that are told about his career when he actually has more evidence to watch his games compared to other guys like Bill Russell. You want to say Bill Russell to go? Cool. I'm glad you watched the five games available on YouTube to come to that conclusion about how great he was in his time. Well, Mike, you can watch a lot of Mike. You can watch a lot of Mike. Like, way more compared to guys like Bill and Kareem. And even when Kareem can watch more than Bill. But with Jordan, I mean, you can go back and watch. If I wanted Kobe with some bop and a bald head, how we go to older Kobe? Like, what are we talking about? I, I I just don't get it. As a person that watched a recent on stream, so there's no way I could possibly be fabricating this. I know some of y'all think I lie. I just recently watched Kareem and I mean not Kareem, Bill and uh Wilt play. I ain't gonna lie, for me personally, era diff. No, so they're out of there, <laughs> they're out of there. I ain't gonna lie. I just I was saw I, I know the rules held him back, but the rules made the game harder to play. Hey, it is what it is, buddy. Both not saying they are not all time great. I am saying no. I, I, I am 50 toes down on Aerodiff. They're out. I hate the idea that some folks in this world still try to die on magic over LeBron, considering they're like the most similar archetype player of all time, damn near. And one is just better. I, I, I don't know how one plays defense better. Damn near passes the same. It's a significantly better finisher at the rim. And the only pause. difference, pause if needed, and the only difference is, even if you want to say they're dead even talent, is situation. Literally one nigga, uh, JR, you got to hit that shot. The other dude, all right, good shit, Kareem. And I'm not I'm not trying to disrespect Magic, but we're comparing him to LeBron right now. It's like, come on, bro. Yeah, I don't I don't I, I refuse to provide numbers and all that extra shit, which I can do, but I refuse to do all of that comparing LeBron and Magic so that he's out. What was the other names? Go ahead, Dama Well. Yeah. Um, to my recollection, Cream also had a baby with the white woman. So Domo, shut that <laughs> Disqualify, hey man, it's okay, day. I'm sorry, disqualify from the conversation. You haven't you reproduce it wow. with the enemy, and you supposed to be in the goat convo. It is MLK day. I did nah, just you are gross. I and just, then, 
Any other person not named Jordan and Kareem, I just think I just think you're doing a little too much. You, you you're being dishonest. Go ahead, Omar. No, because I know where he like they be going in these conversations and stuff like that, and who they choose to prop up and not prop up. Because I saw it when we uh put up the Rashard McCants video and some of these other videos. Just from now on, type your criteria. Type your criteria and make sure that it's consistent. Because if this guy's case is rings and this guy's case is points and this guy's case is, I don't know, peak defense or some shit like that. If it's rings, Bill should be one. Simple. If it's points, well, currently Braun should be one. But before this, Kareem should be one. If it's defense, Bill should be one. Hakeem should be one. Some shit like that. Where, where, where are we? Where's the criteria? Because there's no way that Braun with four can't be over uh, 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 Magic with five, but another nigga with four can be over Magic with five, or you know, or, or, or a nigga with five is over a nigga with ten. You understand what I'm saying? And they say they don't like it when we say nigga in the chat. It's MLK Day. What happened? Yeah, is that? Uh, I saw that. I don't know. Oh, wow. They said, when you refer to players as nigga, <laughs> not on my day. <laughs> not on my day. I beg your pardon. I beg <laughs> your pardon. I don't, I just, truly, for real, for real, though, all jokes aside, I don't know how, if, if Braun with four can't be over somebody with five, somebody five can't be over somebody with 10 or 11, however, the, however many Bill got. So Bill would be Robert Orton should be somewhere in the conversation, right? He yeah. <laughs> five. I get. I get somebody five being under somebody with six, but seven should be right above that, and then ten should be over that, right? I. I think that's how math works. Mm-hmm. Where Where is Where is JoJo White in this conversation? Because I think he got, he he got a few too. So I don't know. Real JJ. Where is James? Nobody John put John Havlicek. No one put John Hav- yeah. Dennis Smith. No one put Dennis Smith in this conversation. This is crazy. <laughs> Brad Samson, I don't know, just some, just some generic ass names. Where are these guys? Walter, okay. something, some nigga back then was named Walter. Yeah, I don't know. You know they had a Polish guy back then too, probably. So Norris Cole, two time champion. <laughs> <What's>, <laughs> hey, when I said uh, <laughs> when I said SGA is better than any guard taller than six two since MJ, somebody in the chat said Mario Chalmers. <laughs> <laughs> I hate niggas, bro. Well, we, uh, funny, y'all funny, bro. I forgot about yeah, Mario. Forgot about Mario. <laughs> I forgot about Mario. <laughs> How could I forget? Ah, uh, that's me, chat. That Mario Chalmers is me. Oh, no, it's just not. <laughs> oh, I it was. 